freaking mamba music. It ain't mamba, it's reggaeton. If you don't like it, get your own radio. Oh yeah, Johnny! Oh yeah, Hector! What do you think, bro? What? The boat of the house! Both, you dopey bastard! Beautiful. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. I just got it. I'm putting a dock in right where you're standing. It's gonna be great. Oh yeah. I'm inviting you and your whole family out for the housewarming. It's gonna be a tremendo party. You bet. How's Mary? Actually, I want to talk to you about that. Remember the thing we talked about last month? I wondered if I could get that. Mary's doctor bills are piling up, and a few dollars more a week could really bail us out. I know, I know, I know. The interest rates are killing me. Look, give me a couple of weeks. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move some things around, and I'm gonna take care of it. Don't worry. I'm gonna take care of it. Johnny, you're my best guy. Johnny! You got your paycheck. Sorry, it's late again. Friggin' accountants. Uh, no worries, thanks. You're welcome. Oh, yeah, um, how's Mary doing? Uh, she's fine. She's resting. She'll be home soon. Good, good. What about you? How you doing? Good. Yeah, you said you said you needed a couple of sick days, but it's been a week. Oh, yeah, well, last I checked, I clocked 42 sick days. You want me back at work, you give me the raise you promised. I'm making the same money staying here, and I got 42 days plus vacation, and that's, what, five into 40? I'll see you in eight and a half weeks. <laughs> Come on, you Johnny, you're killing me. Dad, you got my extension cord. Hey, Chris, how's it going? Listen, I'm missing deadlines. The crew's falling behind. What are you doing here? I'm building a sailboat. <laughs> Oye, pero tú estás loco. A sailboat in your driveway. Well, seeing as it won't fit in the house. Come on, Johnny. Espérate. Chrissy, take this, put it on the kitchen table, and don't lose it. OK. Look at me. It's our money. How many years have I known you? Te voy a dar un consejo. Don't waste your money on this crazy thing. You're already up to your neck and bills with Mary and the... I'll see you at work tomorrow. Does that mean you're giving me a raise? Hey, Greg. How's he doing? He's okay. He's okay. Johnny. Oh, man, this is Oh, upset. no. What? I, Don't do this. Don't do I this. I just, I just, I just can't keep you on any longer. Oh, you gotta be kidding. I am You're sorry. You're gonna fire me? Why? Because our kids got in, into a, a fight because I took sick pay, no, which no. was mine to take? No, no, it has nothing to do with that. It's, things have been rough, that's all. We lost that account in Kendall and the economy. This is not easy for me to do because you are my friend. I'm your friend? I'm your friend. <laughs> you, you have the stones to come here to my house and your fancy car fire me? Tell me you're having it rough? Come on. Johnny, I it... busted my back. 20 years for your family. Your father first, now you. While you go out and buy your, your new house, your new boat, 
would have killed you to give me an extra hundred bucks a week so I could have taken care of my family, my wife's doctor bills? Friend. You were never my friend. Well, this is why Chris has a problem. Excuse me? Chris is a good boy. He's a kind boy. But you wouldn't understand kindness. I love him. I'd do anything for him. But you wouldn't understand that either. So go ahead, Hector. Take your car, your spoiled brat, and, and go play on your fancy boat. Hey. How's that eye doing? Is it my fault he got fired? Um, no. It has nothing to do with you. I don't even think that. I should have known this was going to happen a long time ago. So what are we going to do now? We're going to Vegas. Really? <laughs> no, not really. We're broke. 